where I live the purpose of nurturing talent and promoting art in youth. I'm a self-taught fashion designer, but I was inspired by my mom. My mom was a tailor, and I used to see her on a machine cutting stuff, though she never wanted me to be a fashion designer. And I did computer science, but you know in Uganda, after school, we start seeking for a job. As I was looking for a job, accidentally, I mastered the art of fashion and designing. I'm tired, you get so I'll try to boost you and you work with inspiration. Yes, one technique I can give you we are totally motivated. See, yeah, what inspired me to start the CD shop project basically was the this number of emails and Facebook messages I used to get about. Russ, I need to learn from you. Russ, do you teach? Russ, do you have a school? The, and I never used to care so much. Then it reached a time and it started to reason and say, I think this number of emails I get almost every day have a message. But expect something that is so creative, something that you've never seen before, and something that is got from deep, deep within me. We've had we've had a couple of uh, workshops talking about different things, uh, social media, inspiration, and how to connect that to to the design and whatnot. So, like with everything you do, you it it, it brings. Like, uh, you see a different aspect of, of, of fashion. Seed show grade 16. Now you sign it for you. You don't try to sign it for you. All opportunities are enough for me. Yari Yakube Yaku mentally in Gua Raska Sozi. A very chag in the muscle. And I like Aria, Kuyamba's ambassador, US ambassador. I mean, Brenda. The biggest challenge we're facing now is space because you always gather for meetings, workshops. So we dream to have our own space because still. We got this opportunity, but you have to send a request. Sometimes the space is booked, you get so we dream to have our own space whereby we can run our own projects, meetings, having classes or libraries.